Good evening everyone, it's Angry Turtle Life and yes you see it right, this weekend is double experience weekend. So, if you are a new player, let's say you would follow my guide, zero to here, I mean guide, more like live stream than a guide, you could get level 50 from zero to hero in about three hours. That is the time frame to hit, that's what's possible. So, definitely, if you are in a rush to get to level 50, that's a time. If you need more energy to do it, don't forget to use code TURTLE in case you will be shopping at G Fuel. And I feel a little bit tired today, so I'm using a canned G Fuel. I have a lot of trust in the can, so that's a clickbait taste. It looks very colorful. It looks cool and I was only able to put my hand on this thanks to G Fuel being my sponsor. Otherwise in UK they don't have those cans. So if you are in US, you are in luck, you are actually able to get cans with G Fuel. I'm having the clickbait. All right, it's good. Let me say hi to people in the chat. There is a lot of you in the chat. I don't know where you're supposed to start. So basically where this chat shows for me. Welcome, Derek, Altmaster, Nova Darling, Lauren, Rascal, Counter Medal, Deck La Patron, Sia, Brian, Mario, Martin, Dale, Ash, and Elder Berg. Dale, Glatonus Girl, uh, then the same names keep appearing. Uh, Philip, no capitals. Christer Peterson, astronomical unit. Don's Doom, Turkey Maker, Jake. Welcome to all of you guys. I'm so happy to see you. There's a lot of green names. Special thanks to you. You are my sponsors too. You are my financial supporters. You are my sponsors actually bigger sponsors than any other sponsor I have. That's what I want to tell you. You are my biggest sponsor. So basically, uh, all together, you almost own this channel, I would say. <laughs> you almost own this channel. All together, not separately. Please don't ask me about my password. I'm not, sh I'm not sharing that. And that being said, I think it's time to just hop into Fallout 76. We don't want to waste the time. Oh, Lauren, thanks a lot for five bucks and five hearts. Thank you a lot. Appreciate the gesture. Thank you. How's the weather in UK? Today was amazing. Sun, warm, no wind. You would not know you are in UK if you would be here today. So yeah, unusual <laughs> because so good. And now, Fallout 76, we are hopping in. Fallout 76 awaits for us. Where is my preview? I don't see the preview on my phone. Phone, be nice, show me the preview. Thank you, phone. Oh, muted. Okay. Muted preview. Good. Seems to be working. What's free in the atomic shop? Cups. We take their free cups and we have sale for firewall outfit. How does it look like? Okay, mm. no. The regular fireman outfit that I already own is better. So no. There is kitchen bundle discounted and what I'm missing. Rustic sink, Ho Hollywood floor lamp, wall lamp. Okay, there is a bunch of stuff I'm missing. One, two, three, four, five items for 300 atoms. Okay, I'm taking that. Oh, Clay Mafia Man. Thanks a lot for 10 bucks, Clay Mafia Man. Appreciate that. And the message is for all the help you've brought me in my experience. Thank you very much. I'm happy that I was able to help a little bit. 
and I appreciate this support. And now we are going to adventure. Yes, you can join me if I'm on your friend list. If I am not on your friend list, yes, you can try to send me friend invite. And yes, I would try to accept it, but no, it's not guarantee because my friend list is still bugged. And it would probably be forever. After my long conversation with support, all I was able to figure out that this problem is complicated and there is currently no solution. World is already full, I just log in. How is that possible? My test camp is loading in. I have everything here. That's that's my production department. Popcorn, canned coffee, honey. All those three things are giving AP. The heart AP regeneration. So that's why I like to have a lot of that stuff. And my Nuka Cola production. Like, I don't know how this junkyard dog works. Even if I switch it to Nuka Cola production, it is still bringing up junk. So it's bringing me both. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that. Like, dog is bringing junk and new Coca-Cola, so I like my doggo. Where did he go? Where is my doggo? He's gone. Are you inside? No. My doggo is gone. Who stole my dog? Meat dog. Who stole my meat dog? That's my mechanical meat dog. Not dog meat, he's a meat dog. I don't know. He disappeared. Yeah, legacy friends will be gone soon. Farewell, legacy weapons. But don't worry, if you still want to play, if you are not quitting, I will provide you with all the possible guides how to solo any possible content without owning legacy. And yes, I had some suggestions what are the best replacements for legacy. I would cover that topic too. Mm, what am I doing? What am I doing first? What are the challenges for today? Challenges for today. Collect 100 caps. Oh, I should really claim those caps after logging in, but I will collect one more today, so that's good. Five. Level up. Uh, by the way, not only double experience, but as well double score. So we'll be going. I'm ranked 128. We'll be going up. Uh, oh, we are building floors in my camp. My test camp will be getting more floors, like it needs it, like definitely doesn't need it, but will be getting more. I don't even know if I have a budget for that, so we are trying to squeeze in more floors somewhere. Fit anywhere? No? All, all built? All outside of borders already? Where can I squeeze more floors? I think I will need to destroy some floors. To put more, as it does not fit anywhere. I'm done with floors. Can I put here? No. There is this stupid tree blocking my floors. Nope. Okay. So, we need to destroy 10 floors. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And now we build. Those challenges are stupid. That's why I have one dedicated camp. Just for those challenges. I will not bother claiming workshops. I will just always do it in this camp. There is only one purpose for this camp. And those are challenges. There is no other purpose for this camp. Testing new items with Atom Shop and doing the challenges. Done. Oh, Tarky Maker, thanks a lot for five bucks, mate. Appreciate that. And the message is, your build videos are about to get a lot more attention with Legacy Death. <laughs> yeah, it will be way more important. Like at this moment, you can grab Legacy and it doesn't matter if you have any perk card equipped. You will be doing perfectly fine, but 
Soon you would actually at least need to pay attention what kind of card you are equipping, which in my opinion personally it is a good thing. I'm not saying everyone should min max, but definitely you should at least pay attention what kind of build you want to make, like melee cards or commando or different cards. Like they are there for a reason. Uh, now add will it work? I don't know, I pressed the button. So we start from daily ops, as this is definitely a target for today. What are other challenges? One event, craft, grenade, mine or thrown weapon. Okay. So we are doing it. I'm not crafting without super duper. So as we are crafting this stuff, wait, is it this? workstation for grenades grenades nope not this workstation that's that's the fuzzy station fuzzy station for grenades open <laughs> this this workstation gets me every time i don't know it's just i like hilarious stuff some people are telling me but that's not immersive and so on i know trust me i know that oh i forgot to equip demo expert I know it's not immersive, it's just goofy and hilarious and I love it. There's lots of hilarious stuff in Fallout 76. That's the point. <laughs> I can open it twice. Okay, new canades. and we actually craft whatever I have. All the new Coca-Cola crafted. Yeah, wherever this challenge pop up that reminds me to use my stuff. <laughs> I got experience too. Okay. Now we unswitch it. No, not gunsmith. Makeshift warrior. And super duper no longer needed. Where is my serendipity? Where are you? There. What am I sharing? Am I sharing any card? I'm not sharing a card. Oh, someone is sharing a savior. What I will share you. I'm sharing Ricochet, okay, that's a good card. Should I go a little bit for a troll option? <laughs> Should I? No, okay, I will not be trolling. <laughs> sharing, sharing mysterious meat is hilarious thing. Like you share this card and people playing game are getting more and more meat in their aid category. And if they are not using through hiker, they quickly getting weight up and they don't know what's going on. <laughs> Where all this meat is coming from. That's mystery meat. Okay, I'm not doing that. Okay, okay. Calm down, turtle. Don't troll everyone on the start. Let's do this decryption event. There is plenty of regular weapons in game that are a lot of fun. We go for extra uh, extra endurance. Like you don't have fun weapons, like you don't have fun with auto axe. I do have lots of fun with auto axe. In third person, it's not doing full damage, but still good enough, and I can sprint. Like, I'm using Auto Axe in third person when I want to sprint a lot and attack. As you can sprint and attack with Auto Axe. So yeah, I can sprint and still attack. Oh, Greg Hall, I will remember for two years already. Thank you, Greg Hall. And Greg Hall is having a message I will read after dealing with those guys. Don't stagger me, you're gonna die. They did. Now I can read the message and Greg Hall is saying, I remember when double experience weekend meant choo choo white spring train doing circuits on the white spring and someone being sacrificed at the end. Yeah, it was fun time. Unfortunately, I cannot do it anymore because my friend list is bugged. So I was thinking about it and then I realized I can do it. With bugged friend list, I cannot have friends on my private server. Does it work? So that's a boomer, but I remember the good old times. If 
if you are not here, uh, anyone watching, you want to figure out what Choo Choo Train is, if you put in YouTube search Choo Choo Train, followed 76, you will find it. <laughs> but yeah, you can find it. Why am I looting? Help. Help with daily up. Turtle, stop looting. Okay, code acquired. Oh, uh oh. On decryption, missile launcher super mutants are deadly. Help. Anyone around to help me? I'm saved! Thank you. Thank you, good people from my team. I am saved. What are we doing? Run. I see you, super mutant. How? No, how dare you? You almost killed me. That's the only downside with running auto axe build. Like, on decryption op, I should use. Dodgy, but I cannot use Dodgy without popping a lot of canned coffees and I'm trying to save some. So I don't want to constantly drink canned coffee, so I cannot equip Dodgy. I'm coming. Will I get there on time? Nope. Too late. Oh, but we already... Look at the time! Look at that! That's a, that's a time! Good job, everyone! That was 3 minutes, 27 seconds. Insanely fast. Bethesda shut down my friend list? No, that's not the case. <laughs> Thank you, Greg Hall. Yes, we did somehow hit 71k subscribers. Anyone need Barrow Science? <laughs> I keep getting those. I know no one needs this. Load. It's Moonshine Jamboree, but do I want to do Moonshine Jamboree? i quite certain I want to do Expedition. I don't need Moonshine Jamboree. There will be plenty of Legacy people there. No, I'm doing Expedition. We'll do Moonshine Jamboree after Legacy will get fixed and we'll see what will be the difference. So next month. No, 100, 100k subscribers is not so easy. Eventually, maybe? Definitely not quick. <laughs> not quick. Here we go. My super powerful auto axe build is ripping through enemies like nothing. Even in third person. That's the damage in third person. Actually, if I want to run more in third person, I should equip one card that I don't have currently equipped. Maybe I will equip it. Place. For running in third person, I need to swap something in here. Can I run without bear arms? Maybe I can. If I unequip bear arms and... Oh, I don't have this perk, so... Where are you? There it is, Martia Artist. If you run Auto Axe in third person, it actually benefits from swing speed. It attacks faster, so... I want to run today in third person. 
And let's see how well I would be doing without the attack speed bug that currently exists in first person. See, I, I'm attacking faster. Which is good. That's enough damage. I think that's enough damage now. Oh, food. Let eat and drink, Yaogwai. I will save roast ribs. Mm. I think my tasty squares too is still running or not. I don't know. I will take a fresh one. Sweet water blend. Need to cook some of this stuff. Roast heart. Ribeye steak. Red scorpion steak. Poach Angler. Mutant Hound Stew and Mutant Hound Chops. I'm buffing up. Glowing Steak. Uh, Death Row Wellington? Just Steak. Steak will be fine. And that's it. Do I need anything else? Oh, Scorchby's brain. And bloodbag steak. Yeah, that's for extra health. Okay. Now I'm buffed up. Okay. I'm buffed up. Yeah. Now we are shredding. Should loot something occasionally. There will be this ammo box from next month, so I will store the ammo somewhere. Yeah, I'm good. What is my damage? 177.33. That is really good. Okay, done. I'm heading back. Coming. How many canned coffee do I have at this moment? 15. I definitely need to do better on canned coffee. Hello there, Hex. Please give me my next quest. Hex! Hex! Talk. Okay. First person. Talk. Hex? Stupid Hex! Talk to me! Oh, you actually need to call him stupid. Then he talks. Or she. I'm not... I'm not sure. He, she, or they. Wicker. Give me quests. Thank you. Finally, we have that sorted. Don't know why there is such a problem to talk with people in... third person. Why they don't want to talk? Oh, we are already done with stealing goods? Wow. Those guys are fast. Those guys I have on a team are crazy fast. Definitely faster than me. I, I'm the turtle speed. I, I take my time. I do stuff. Carnivore Melly is amazing. Like, as I said, opposite as in real life. Like, if I'm currently vegan in real life, I play carnivore in game. After I switch, I need to switch to herbivore in game. That's important. I, I heard beeping. There is beeping. Not, not here. Somewhere in here? Oh, above me. Here. Got it. Oh, look at that. I just received a free meat. This free meat is cool, but I'm getting way more free meat than I can use. From time to time, I just need to sell it to a vendor. Ah, that's the damage. I like the damage. May the damage be with you. Hello there, rabbit. 
And in that person I can just keep sprinting. It's all fine. It is cool. Prisoner case. Now we are freeing prisoners. Where are the prisoners? Oh, there. He's faster than me! Run after him! No. Oh, he won! Okay. Okay, I will wait for those guys to do those objectives. I'm gonna kill this guy. He tried to stop me. Look how nice it is in third person. Like, can Bethesda do the same mechanic for the first person? I can jump, I can sprint while simultaneously attacking with the auto axe. Why I cannot do it in first person? Oh, chem lab. Oh, I'm lost. Where am I? Canal. There. Found the way. I found the way. You give me a mixture. Okay, what are we collecting? Sealing agent from containers. Oh, that's a prisoner. Okay, that's not what we are attacking. More sealing agent. Where is more sealing agent? Oh, we don't need that anymore. Oh, we just need one more fanatic. Those poor guys died. I will... I will do it. I'm doing it. I did it. Oh, we're already going to the pen. Wait a second, where is the path? There is top in here? Oh, I leveled up already. That's the... Oh. That's not the way. I think I'm lost. Mm. Where was it? Here. Here. Found it. I'm so good, I found the way. Why this microphone is so high? Move away. Oh, and thank you a lot for all those likes. I do like those. Who doesn't like likes? Thank you. And if you press the dislike, you know what I think about this button. It just feel better button. I stopped using the dislike button myself when YouTube changed the rules and no one can see it. I was like, no, I'm protesting the dislike button by not using it on videos I don't like. There are videos I don't like. I'm not, not talking about any Fallout creators, but generally. I just don't press the button. If you need to, feel better button is really good. Will make you feel better. Oh, we have another 10 bucks from Cracker Jackcat. Thank you a lot, Cracker Jackcat, for 10 bucks. And the message is... Thanks for the great streams, videos, and the great Turtle Army folks. Thank you a lot. Yeah, Turtle Army is keeping this channel on top. I don't know if it's the biggest follow channel, but yeah, Turtle Army definitely. So many of you is sharing my videos in your communities that somehow those are known. Like, people do recognize me on servers, <laughs> which was not the case two years ago. Now it is. Oh, I don't actually need to talk with him, but okay. When he asks, I will talk with him. 
I need to talk with this guy. Hello. Hex? Yeah, of course. Hex do not talk to me. If I don't call him stupid, stupid Hex talk to me. Yeah, exactly. I call him stupid and then he talks to me. Or she. Or they. I have no idea what the Hex gender is. Hello, Lennox. Give me good rewards, please. I want to see them. Good rewards. Hey, I want to see my legendary. It's not showing them anymore. Come on. That's cheating. I want to see them. They will be on the new tab. We'll check them. What scoreboard level I'm at? I'm approaching 130. I think 129 or maybe 130 already. We'll check. It's she. Dale saying she. Rascal saying it. <laughs> Spack saying Tonton. <laughs> oh, guys, you're trolling me. Okay, what's new? It's basically getting Hellcat pieces. What? Aristocrats. Hellcat. Left arm. That's a script. Trapper. Left arm. That's a script. Medic. Alien disintegrator with faster reload damage. But it's medics. I don't want it. Another Hellcat that's mutant with less explosion damage. For super tanks, less explosion damage is actually a good option. Oh, it's a Sentinel too. If this would be overeaters, <laughs> it would be the best possible role. But it's not overeaters. It's regenerating. Okay. So. We store power armor pieces on my script frame for later. Oh, okay. Okay, that's it. Sorted. We scrap stuff. Plasma, handmade pipe, revolver, western revolver. Just piece. We grab stuff. Don't want any more gamma rounds. Honey, can't coffee. Yeah, we're stocking up on this can't coffee. Okay. Still have a lot of carry weight left, and I could improve it even more if I would like to, but I'm good. So. What are we doing now? Let me check. Challenges daily. One event. Oh, drink three new Cacolas and kill ten Myrlux. Okay, drink three new Cacolas. Which new Cacola would I like to drink now? Orange. And Sherry. Done. Now, which Myrlux would I like to kill? Some challenging my looks for me, so this will be Sunrise Field. Oh yeah, you almost done Astronomical Unit without doing the pit or daily ops? That's a good result, yes. I, for the first couple of weeks I was doing everything. Now I'm not anymore because I'm just so high on the scoreboard. Let me see if I can deal with them in third person. Obviously, I can in first person, so let's see how much harder it will be in third person. Come on, Marlux. Show me what you got. Um, I do have star genes. Do I have... What kind of mutations do I have? Oh, I have unstable isotope. Why do I have this mutation? That's not my plan. 
That wasn't planned. And where is the... No, oh, there you are. I was missing you. Why are you sitting on my head? My queen, the diseased one. Oh, she's doing some damage, but I won. I won, my queen. Thank you for your service. All right. What is next on our to-do list? Challenges. Oh, that's not enough. Marlux. So, which Marlux would you add, like to add to our collection? I think we would go to Query because I have removed squatters there. And those are Marlux. Let me kill them. Poor Milo the Milo, yeah. <laughs> Poor Milo the Milo. There is another queen in there. She's deep underwater, so let's try to wake her up. I need to. I better use Radaways. She will be. Oh. Could you please get out of the water? Oh, Mr. Pricebot. Thank you, Mr. Pricebot. Wow, oh, she's running on me. She's angry. She's angry and we are fighting her. Oh, maybe I should for comparison go for first person. Look at the difference. <laughs> oh, wow, it's so crazy. First person is like five times the damage. My looks are dead. And squatters? Squatter is done? That's not enough my looks. Was that enough my looks? Let's see if there is one more Miluk over there on the inside, but probably not, as I did the squatters thing. He's dead. And magazine is not here. So someone was here. But I hear nothing, so someone was in here. And yes, I can hear magazines. In the past I was... What am I doing? I was ignoring those perks. Now those are one of my favorites. Perceptive Bobble and Panapictographist. Those perks? Amazing. What's... What? Are you kidding? Are you kidding me? Okay. You wanted that. Not me. So don't cry now. You don't shoot. If you see a scary guy with a bloody suit, with a pumpkin head, with flames, you don't attack. You run away. Okay. Challenges. Daily swan event. Still two more Milux. Okay. So we are visiting... Cranberry Glade. Oh, someone is dropping nuke. Awesome. Cranberry Glade. My look chase. Oh, Alan Skill. I'm happy that my content helped you level up. Congratulations on level 100. I will help you. You're welcome. Oh. What? No disappearing. And that's by the way, everywhere you have cranberry something in name. Those are good places to gather your cranberries if you are a herbivore. So we're done with my looks and the nuke is coming down in two minutes. So I should probably report for duties and check my... Do I have... Yeah, Enforcer is there already. Enforcer on the ready. And the reason for Enforcer is... This amazing pepper shaker. Oh, why is it... What? Instigating... What? Should be this one. The the wheel. If you have two items that are both pepper shakers, that's my pepper shaker. 
Weightless, damage while aiming, and anti-armor. That's my staggering shaker. The game is sometimes trolling me hard. Yeah, if you want to see my Fallout Shelter videos, those are on my second channel. Live streams. I mean live streams. Those are not videos. Fallout Shelter live streams. Yeah, we are ready! I feel a little bit like evil character in this outfit. All those bloody skulls, pumpkin head. I did it for the bloodied melee build because it fits the team. Normally I wear the goofy stuff and now I really look like a badass. What do you think? <laughs> I'm ready. Pepper Shaker is reloaded. The nuke is coming. I saw the impact behind the forest. And Queenie is flying over. Legacy are already chopping off her health. Come on, Legacy users. Wait, at least I try to cripple her first for you. Can I hit the wing? I cannot see a thing. Did I cripple the wing or not yet? Oh, she's dying! No! Regener... That's the problem with Legacy. She does, doesn't even have opportunity to land. Land. No, don't die yet. Wait, lovely Legacy users. Wait a second, I want to use attack her with melee. That's why I have this crippling weapon. So she will land. I'm there. I am able to do something. So I will get my rewards. That's amazing. Let's do more damage. Oh, I change. I, I intend to change to first person. What happened? First person. The finishing touch. The finishing touch. And she is indeed dead. Good job, everyone. We got her. Furious Gauss rifle. Two stars. Event completed. Troubleshooters Helka with AP refresh. So almost good. Where is the tent? There is someone's tent. I need to store this crap. Don't want to accidentally lose the scrap. Here we go. All right. Now I will scrap some of those legendaries as they are getting heavy. Oh, we didn't switch to casual. You are absolutely right, Sean. I will do that now. Yes, launchers, explosive launchers can have two shot and two shot on launchers is way better than on anything else because it doubles the damage actually. I don't know if it's intended or not, but it doubles the damage. Oh, first I forgot to store the script part. What is the script that we get? Right leg. Oh, we already have right leg there. I need another frame. We'll be doing more stuff, so maybe I take like two more frames to fill up or three? One, two, three. Okay, that's how much script will save for the next week for me. That's what we are saving for the next week, as 
During the week I don't farm, so I farm on weekends. As during the week I do go to work, so I don't farm. I do some daily stuff, but only briefly, so... I need this stuff. And... We, oh, did it reset yet? What time yesterday I did that? Okay, it didn't reset yet. So we keep collecting until it resets. What is this over... That's a two star. Okay, we keep farming until it resets. I did all the dailies. Done. So now we are on weeklies. One more level up. Collect purified water. Oh, I forgot about this. Collect vertebrate fuel. We can collect 100. Complete daily operations, daily challenges. So I need to play tomorrow. Complete more events. Craft ammo at the workbench and deal a critical hit to enemy. I can do those two. You know what's the trick with this build? Oh, someone started encrypted. The trick with this build is this. Why is it instigate? It's not instigating that's supposed to be game. Fix itself. That's the trick to do those criticals with pepper shaker. It's even better if this will be single barrel, but that that's fine. I will go there first. Don't want to miss it. And I'm intentionally using Pepper Shaker without changing magazine this time. For two reasons. It's weightless. But this weight reduction do not apply to mods, so I try to reduce unnecessary mods, so I have standard magazine as I'm using it for crippling. And second one, the other magazines, there is projectile flight time, why with uh, those, those are like scan hit. So regular shotgun shells, this is instantaneous hit. And we need to craft this ammo for ammo crafting. I like to go for cheap ammo. So ammo. 50 cal rounds. Free. And we're done. So I'm rank 130, soon 140. Need to hit something. Get those criticals done. Come on. I need those criticals. Why I'm using shotgun for criticals? What is someone sharing dodgy? No? Why I'm losing? Why I'm losing AP on hit? I don't have diseases. I don't know what's going on here. I did couple criticals. You see? 25 done. I just did like maybe four. And that already counted, so that's why you use shotgun for critical challenges. Automatic shotgun is the best. You just two free bursts without changing any pair cards, and you done with those critical challenges. You don't actually need 25 criticals because every projectile count as one. So that's that's a handy trick if you would ever need one. Is, is he already dead? No, he's alive. And now he's dead. I managed to put my axe on it. I managed to put my axe on it at least a little bit. So that is done. And which part of my armor is breaking? I would like to know that. This part. And this part. I don't like my armor being broken. And that seems to fix it. Now we have this left arm to store. Which one have room for left arm? There is already left arm on this one, so we store this left arm here. Where is it? There. Store it. Okay. Let me use the special holotape. Mm. No, 
on M. Missile silo state holotape. Let's figure that out. So Charlie was launched. Alpha and Bravo is available. There is someone in Alpha. And no one at Bravo. I'm going to Bravo. Yeah, I know. I only have 134 repair kits left. I don't know if I don't have any in my stash box by any chance. It can be more. Scorch Beast Queen is so good for Reaper Kids that she's giving me so much of that. I like her for those Reaper Kids. Yeah, the, the ammo box that's coming with next patch. This is huge for Fallout First users. And I think they are not increasing Fallout First price. At least I hope not, so that will be good. I hope they do not increase. Please, Bethesda, don't look for excuses. Giving us more stuff is not a reason to increase the price, so I hope we are not doing that. It's surprisingly empty, like robots do not even bother with pumpkin head guy running around. Excuse me, Mr. Robot, I'm busy here. I need to get my authorization. Done. Excuse me, Mr. Robot. Registration complete. I'm proceeding. I will actually need a regular, some kind of red oasis. Or maybe I use grape. Nuka Cola. Where is that? Don't die. Where is. I don't see this Nuka Cola. Grape. Finally. Nuka Cola grape. Getting 200 experience per hacking. <laughs> the hacking? Okay, nice. Oh, being attacked. You're dead. Oh, Lauren in Wasteland. Thank you a lot for 10 bucks at Foxy Heart. Thank you, Lauren. Appreciate that. Thank you. And now we need to get in here and place my power armor. And... Oh, come on. Why oh, cannot... Oh, it was there. Oh, I did it. Squeezing in. I put it a little bit too far. Squeezing between the crates, very important. Over encumbered in that. Getting out. And now we'll be launching the nuke. Oh, we have a welcome party. Hello there, welcome party. iBots. I like how on adventure servers, turrets do not respawn, so if on this server someone launched a nuke hours ago, the turrets are gone forever. <laughs> that is so cool. Don't need to deal with turrets anymore. Just, you, you see? It was lunch before, because that dead, dead robots are everywhere. And new ones will be lunch now. Oh, I'm over encumbered? I think my food expired. We need better carry weight food, so better carry weight food is pepperoni roll. Fixed. 
How dare you? How dare you shoot at me, launch commander? Give me this aluminum. Aluminum is a precious scrap because aluminum is used to produce new canates. I still have a lot, but I continue farming because you never know when aluminum will get low in your stash box. So it's better to keep adding. I have two minutes to keep protecting that and then I will need to exit. Where is the new going on? It's another... Yeah, it's another Scorch Beast Queen nuke. If those robots could hurry up, but they will not. I could drop a nuke on Earl in the same time, because there is more time to join Earl, but I was too slow. It could be two nukes simultaneously and we would still do it both. But I was too slow. Oh, where are you going, Mr. Robot? Die. Oh, wait. I heard something. I think it's level above. Yeah, it's there. Okay, so I cannot get there. <laughs> That's fine then. It's not here. The sound of a magazine, but not in here. I will not be able to stay with those robots long enough. Hopefully they can do without me. I need to go. We deal with those protectrons. Where is this guy shooting? There. So I need to go. I deal with them all. Okay, I need to go. There's no time. Oh, come on, countdown. Big shot at. Okay, again. Can I do it? No, not the countdown again. Okay, switch off the light, hide. Yeah, I hope the silo will keep going. That's the plan. Cost of summoning imposter? It's not too high. Like, I have so many imposter cards. You start making good caps, you have those cards. Hello there, Scorchby Queen. Cripple. She is indeed landing. Here we go. Slice and dice. Done. She is dead indeed. Need to scrap some stuff. Over encumbered. Hunter's excavator piece. Roadsider. Yeah, I know the terror has been ended. We know that. Okay, fixed. Back to the silo. Oh, bravo. Yeah, we'll be doing another pit expedition in a second.
after Mr. Arrow. Mr. Arrow first, and then another pit expedition. We can actually do three. I can start three pet pit expeditions. I have battery, f battery fully charged. We already did one, so that would be second one now. And I didn't start daily challenges yet, so I have recharge. I can recharge the battery and do it third time. Oh, come on. Open. Open the door. Run. Excuse me. Excuse me. Just passing by. Don't look at me. Need to place the armor better this time. Okay. That far? Okay, that's perfect placement now. Let's launch the nuke. Yeah, two of the section chefs have been killed. I'm not happy with that. Let's try to prevent more killing. Stop killing! Stop the violence! No, stop the violence! No! No! Don't torture this guy, stop the violence! Oh, complete. Oh, uh, codes. Codes where I have those. Okay, and here I have the codes open on my phone. We are in Bravo. Yeah, we are in Bravo. Three. Four, two, three, six, eight, nine, three. Done. We are not nuking Scorch Biscuit. I have enough repair kits. We are nuking Mr. Errol. Nope. Here. And before we go there... What? Being shot at. How dare you! Okay. And I see Radiation Rumble is going on. Let's join it. Do I think it would be hard to replace explosive effect with faster fire rate? I don't know. Generally what developers are doing, they're removing all the effects that shouldn't be possible on particular weapons, not only explosive. So that's a very wide range wipe out. Basically, everything that you cannot roll through legendary crafting at this moment is being removed not just explosive effect on energy weapons whatever is not possible to roll they are removing it which caused a bug as well because you cannot roll a named legendary weapon so they accidentally wipe out named legendary weapons but i'm quite certain they will add exceptions for those before it will go live here we go Oh, it's hard to tag. Okay, I have a better idea then. So we are competing with a lot of people. I don't need damage. What I need is blast radius for new canades. And that's how I will be tagging. Oh, and I hitting myself? No, that's not good. That's how I will be tagging them. 
Do I send you canites from time to time? And I hit myself a couple times. Oh, come on. How far do I need to move? I will kill myself. Someone is shooting my grenades. Uh, right away. Rat shield and right away. That will fix that. Doing it with new canades. New canade strategy. I will, I will get my level up really soon. Look at that. There is the level up. <laughs> I have those knights. I'm using them. I don't need legacy. I can use regular knights to tuck absolutely everything. New canades are great. They do hit through the walls. So there is nothing that can get in the way of my new canade. And Colossus is starting. I have five minutes to join it. So I, I stay here until like two minutes left on the event. I want some of this. Exp oh, Scavenger died? Oh, how that happened? I'm not paying attention to Scavengers. Who's killing Scavengers? Oh, no one is checking those. Okay, console jokey, I will kill you. Console jokey healed. My bad, I should be the healer. I have friendly fire. But I didn't heal console jokey. Oh. What's going on in here? Okay, expert healed. I'm healing them. I need to pay attention to those health bars. Even though I will not be here for event completion, but still. I don't think anyone is actually gathering any of the resources. Everyone is for double experience weekend purposes killing those ghouls. <laughs> no one gathers resources. Gathering resources is very unpopular. Oh, jetpacks are not yet addressed on PTS. So I don't know if it's planned. Personally, I would really like to see additional chest slot exclusive to just jetpacks being added by Bethesda. That would I would like to see. If that would ever happen, I don't know. I cannot tell. Oh, console, console jokey, console jokey, no, no jokey, don't die, I will help you, I will save your life, console jokey, come on, we'll save you jokey, he's feeling much better now, he's feeling much better after being, after after quick auto axe surgical procedures to keep him alive. I'm such a skilled person that I can commence surgical procedures with auto axe. Come on. Oh no. I cannot join when I'm being attacked. Can I get a little bit radiation healing? Thank you. I totally forgot using right away that I can just use that. Okay, here we go. Yeah, you, you, you don't have the skill to commence surgical procedures with auto axe? I was thinking that that's a common wasteland knowledge. How to commence those procedures. No bubblehead. Teddy bear is there. Yeah, everything under control. Here we go. 
Mr. Earl. I am coming. All right. Everyone ready? I think my buffs expired already. How are my buffs? Yeah, the regular buffs expired, so I need a new one. By roast and trips. Whiskey. Is more buffs. Those are not cooked yet. I need to cook it. Roast heart. Red scorpion steak. Water. Popcorn poach angler. Mutant hound chips. And glowing meat steak. Deathclaw Wellington. Oh, come on, I didn't finish. Uh, where's the liquid courage? I don't have. The liquid courage? Okay, good. We're good. Okay, I have a little bit too much health. Have a little bit too much health. Just eat some angler meat, bloatfly meat. Okay, good. I'm coming. Oh, he already took so much damage? What happened? Who did so much damage to him before we even started? Okay, here we go. And it does look like we are doing great without any legacy being used in here. There's auto access, I can hear fixers. Someone is using knife. <laughs> We're doing good. I'm taking a lot of radiation. I think I have a disease. Oh no, come on, AP. Can't coffee for consistent auto axing. Oh, it's not like any source of hard AP region prevent auto axe from stopping. Or maybe not, and it stops for a moment, so there must be a minimum required. Okay. Where is... Where is Mr. Arrow? Give me everything. Whoa! Wendigos. Do we have more Wendigos over there? Uh oh Help! I irradiated myself too much! Thank you! You are great! Thank you very much! There is more one because where are they coming from? Whoa! I got snapped! Another one? Are we done? Not done yet? Why? Where are those Wendigos still coming from? Looting that. I'm looting everything. Oh, that was a legacy. <laughs> More stuff. I'm generating more meat. I need to sort out this meat situation. Okay, ready. Can I survive the radiation outside? I have 600 radiation resist. I should be able to survive a little bit. Maybe I will just use run one, one right away. I don't want power armor. Chainsaw is not superior to auto axe. If you fully boost your damage, Auto Axe will go in front. If you not, then Chainsaw will go in front.
Oh, Rascal, that was you with your railway rifle doing this damage. <laughs> okay. Yeah, railway rifle is really powerful. That's one more Wendigo. What's so funny, Rampul Stump? Assassin's Combat Shotgun. Not getting any rats? Hmm. That's good. Oh, I'm getting rats though. I need to move farther. Oh no, I have wrong tent. Forgot to change it when I claimed that, and now I'm running with it. Starch box, that's the scrap box. Scrap box should do it. Yeah, just, just enough. Now, let me go to my camp, sort out this stuff. Yeah, never push air into the wall or the corner. Keeping him on the middle is important. And don't forget, if you are using automatic melee or basher minigun, you can keep push you can push him around. So make sure you're pushing him towards the middle. Then he will not bug out. That is kind of important. Putting some veggies as I will be cooking. Cooking time. Back at back. We are cooking. That's the amazing cooking station. I love it. It's huge. I don't need to look for it. I always see where it is. Get me some boiled water. Now we're going not not meat category. Yao Guai roasts. I can have two. Then do I need no I don't need stingwing stew. A uh, stingwing filet is for strength. Let's go for stingwing uh, scorch beast lang. No, not that scorch beast steaks. Do I want scorch beast steaks? I don't think so. I should actually save resources for cranberry scorch beast something stuff. Uh, where is it? Cranberry meatball grinder. I forgot to pick up cranberries. I have meat. Okay, next time I will pick up cranberries. This one gives enormous amount of health for carnivores. Okay, back, back to the list. Scorch beast heart. Roast sloth. Ribeyes, poach anglers, mutton meat pie, that's the melee damage here, and mutton chops, we are saving that for later, the meat and hound stew, hound chops, and what else, is soft, no, not the cake, nope. Uh, no, I don't need ground more rats because I already have a uh, scorch beast uh, liver. No, not the liver. Something. Lungs. Scorch beast lungs are giving agility. So that's covered. Glowing meat steaks. And. Oh, scorch beast livers. Those are for luck. Bloodbuck steaks, that's what I'm currently using for health. Okay, I think we're done with cooking. And I accidentally scrapped... 
I accidentally scrapped the vocal sack so I cannot make liquid courage. Oh, I have some in my storage, so I'm making that. Oh, I'm missing what? I need more boiled water and razor grains. Come on. I want to be done with that. Okay, we need to gather water. So, hold the drink button and spam the collect button. Okay. Now more razor grains and corn. I don't want auto axe. You don't harvest corn with auto axe. Yeah, it's all growing everywhere. I have too many plants in this camp. That's sorted. Okay, is that enough? Oh, cook the water first. Cook the water, don't boil it. I mean, don't burn it. Don't burn the water. We have water. Now, liquid courage and all vocal sacks have been processed. Put it into my fermenter. Done. Or load it. Now we re equip Mystery Meat. And before we head for the expedition, I will start cooking a soup. Is there a way to join my server lobby? Yes, you can send me a friend request. If it will work, I will accept it. Or other than that, you can send a friend request to anything who's on my server. Those are like people running around and those are the friend requests that are popping for me. And I can try to accept those. Will it get actually accepted? I don't know as I have 2000 over 2000 friends and they are not showing here because it bugged out. I added too many friends and I destroyed my friend list. I didn't know that would happen. I had no idea too many is not healthy. I was thinking more friends the better. It's not the case. There is a limit. You need to stay under 1000 friends. Uh, wood scraps. 50. Please accept donation of those wood scraps. What? What is Max? <gasps> oh no! Ah! Okay. I did it in wrong order. So now only one expedition left. Ah, Tertul, what are you doing? I supposed to start it first, then do the dailies. And then I saw the max and I was like, what? No. I ruin it. Now my battery will be 75% charged if I do remaining two. Ah, bad Tertul. I ruin it. Uh, so we are doing this. We are doing this land. I messed up. My bad. Oh, turtle, turtle, what are you doing? Hex, why are you injured? What happened this time? Yes, we'll help you. Talking will help and you will get up, okay? You see? You talk to her and she she instantly feels better. And we are looking for fanatic manhunters. This fanatic manhunter will be hiding somewhere in here.
That's a sharpshooter. Where is the manhunter? Oh, I leveled up. Oh, there is a manhunter. We hunted the manhunter. Am I still missing some weeklies or I did them all? Oh, still missing all. Yeah, it didn't even count it for a challenge. I ruined it. I ruined it. it. Didn't even count it for a challenge. That's so bad. Why I did that, I don't know. I just wanted to do everything too fast. Where is the manhunter? Manhunter. Don't stagger me, please. Target eliminated. Oh, look at all this ammo. Oh, Chrysalan Hook. Thanks a lot for joining Turtles Army. We do appreciate your support. Thank you very much. And I hope you will enjoy wearing your green colors from now on. Welcome to army, Tertus army. Uh oh, open cumbered. You need to drop health. Drop the health. Reload. More. Still not enough. That's fixed now. I'm coming. Well, how about that? Open the door. Go they lazy on, today. Group. Normally they open the door before I'm here and I'm in first person so stupid hacks talk to me. See? You need to address, address correctly, so then she talks to you. Okay, done. Oh, I'm done. Yeah, you're done. I really need to check if I have anything for scrapping, as I'm close to carry weight limit. Yeah. Okay, let's get rid of all of that. Okay, that's done. Running. We already done with stealing guts. Nice. That was quick. Good job, team. Like, if you have really good team on those expeditions, it goes so fast. It's like around 10 minutes per expedition. It's the fastest ever way of farming endgame stuff in Fallout 76. If you have three friends, I'm showing four, with you four, if you have four people, three friends, and if you all do expeditions together, so you can do four expeditions every day, and all those expeditions not only give you stamps, but, what am I looking, oh, we're looking for saves, but apart from that, they give you all the legendary stuff, and they give you all the legendary modules and legendary script. So you are crafting endgame gear just so quickly. It is insane how fast you can craft endgame gear. If you do those expeditions. You still need time. That will be still almost an hour or about an hour to do those four expeditions. But you definitely can. And you can even do it to the extent that three people starting expedition one or two while other two are doing their dailies to start the next one so you don't even wait separately for doing the dailies to charge the battery you need a good team for that you need three friends to be able to do that efficiently but if you really want to you can achieve that I have all my endgame gear I wanted already, so it's not such a big concern for me. 
I'm only saving those legendary modules for later. But for those people that ask me where I have all my legendary modules from, Expeditions. This is the source. This is where you get all your legendary modules from. If you want them really fast, one to two modules per expedition. If you do four, so you'll get from from four to eight modules on top of your script. I'm lost again. Okay, that's taken. So on top of your script, you will have up to eight modules every day. And eight modules is worth 400 scripts. So basically, you double up on your daily script if you do four expeditions. And now we are tossing coolant. Kool-Aid. Tossing the Kool-Aid. Run. Look how goofy it looks like when you run like that. Toss it. Okay, didn't exactly fly to the second one, but that's fine. We will toss again. Oh, didn't fly to any? How it didn't count? Oh, come on, game! Okay, I need to toss in first person or those grenades are not going anywhere. Yeah, now it goes, okay. Now it goes. I don't know why. In third person, those grenades are like... flying to the side. I don't understand it, but... Tossing grenades, definitely first person thing. Oh, it's already done. Never let your guard down. I understand. I'm not letting my guard down. Get back here oh. as soon as you can. We've got another talk. Right Focus. Stop talking. I forgot to loot the kitchen. Those are my pepper and salt supplies. That's one thing. And there is a magazine somewhere, so... I accidentally ate something. And spices. You know how much pepper and salt is in here? This kitchen is amazing. And there is a magazine, Scout's Life. My apologies to everyone waiting. Turtle is looting the kitchen. Look at that. All those tables. All this salt. And as carnivore, you need a lot of pepper and salt for your crafting purposes, so... Oh, and look at that! I want a cake! Always, always fresh cake. My apologies. <laughs> On it! <laughs> I was looting the kitchen. We are, we are going. Coming, coming, coming. <laughs> True Yakuda saying, looking for friends, have cups. <laughs> Do I have a legendary Fatman build? Yeah, I have explosive build that includes Fatman. But generally, Fatman build is about criticals. Criticals with a Fatman, those are so deadly. You saw my video where I killed uh, with a fat man, Mr. Earl? So yeah, you don't need legacy. You can kill Earl with a fat man. Oh, Turkey Maker. Thanks a lot for two bucks, Turkey Maker. And Turkey Maker is saying lucky cake. Yeah, it was a lucky cake. I don't know what's the chance of getting the cake, but it is low. We have flamers out to access. Where is the fighter? Fighter is taking damage. Hello there, fighter. You are healthy now. Oh, the boss. And he's a legendary this time around. And this legendary is dead one. That's a dead legendary boss. Okay, Hex. Let's talk about it. 
What just happened in here? Completed. Heading out. I will be so over encumbered with all those legendaries now. Hopefully my script reset and I can I can release those legendaries. I don't have as much room. Yes, Lennox, I am ready. And look at that, again, two legendary modules. That's how you farm the modules. Level one pipe pistol can solo Earl? Maybe? Like with perfectly boosted build? Who knows, maybe, yeah. But 44 pistol probably can't. I don't know. I hope it can't because I said before that it can't and I can be wrong. <laughs> I forgot weaker. That doesn't matter. You don't need to talk to weaker. Oh, the arena and sensor. Thank you a lot for two bucks. And the message is RIP legacy weapons and a lot of crying face emoji. Pure arena and sensor. We are with you. I know it. it, it is painful when you lose this stuff. I would really prefer if Bethesda will make the chance so Legacy will do confetti stuff. What I was saying on the Turtle cast, like, my preferred fix will be to change the projectile override to still be a projectile override, but no damage bonus, just small confetti on impact. Regardless what Legacy weapon it was, like, give it a new effect. Without any damage bonus, confetti. Not too loud, small confetti sound and confetti impact. That's how I would like it to be. Let's see if my script reset. Oh, hello there, Mr. Nimbus. The legacy weapons are leaving us with next update. That what is happening to them. It didn't reset yet. Okay. That's not a good news. Oh, there's a victory notice only good events today. We need to you need to go there. Oh, right leg is already in here. Oh, there is right leg here too. Uh, I need script 2 to store this right leg. Okay, now everything is stored. Oh, no, not everything. Right arm. Now I have everything stored. Yes. Oh, Jairus, mate. Thank you a lot for 20 bucks, Jairus. Appreciate that. Thank you. And uh, the message from Jairus is good riddance legacies. Although they did do legacy owners pretty dirty. Yeah, that is true. As there is no replacement. That's what I don't like. That. I, that's why I wanted, really, to give all those weapons that uh, they are removing. What? I had spiked, not unlocked yet? That's a surprise. This confetti effect, to keep them, like, sentimental value, keep, like... I don't understand why it needs to be totally removed. Yeah, Eviction Notice is the best event. There's so many legendaries, so much script. Like, easily, yeah, you can easily live with one pound, one thousand pounds of loot. Basically half a ton. <laughs> half a ton of loot in Wasteland. I probably can use Shaker as a tagging weapon. Oh, 
Oh, why is no one... Can someone repair the scrubber? Oh, okay. No. No one is repairing the scrubber? Do I need to... Okay, completed. For a moment I was like, if no one repairs the scrubber, we'll fail before it starts. Thank you for boxes. See, Shaker is amazing for destroying those bugs. It doesn't matter how much damage you do. You only need to tag them, so that's great. I don't want to do damage, I just want to tag them all. Hello there, Mr. Super Mutant. I already tagged you. What is going on in there? Is there a Super Mutant? Oh, there is a Super Mutant. Oops. Yeah, the legacy weapons go brrrr. They destroy everything. <laughs> but... That's the last month it's happening. So I don't mind people having legacy weapons at this point to enjoy them. This is like last month you can, so... Why not? At this point, I absolutely understand legacy users going all in on those. Oh, I forgot I have crippling pack, so I basically disable all those super mutants by shooting them. Yeah, you need to do a little bit of damage here. Yeah, 1% to get credit, that's true. Oh, no one destroyed this meat bag yet. But for meatbags, I think it's amount of hits that count, not how much damage. There's two hits with this shaker with barely any damage and it works. And in case of super mutants, dealing 1% damage is not something tough to do. So even with not optimized stuff, I, I can deal with 1% damage. The only problem with Shaker, it doesn't really have a great range, so... If they really far, it is possible I will not do good damage. I'm getting experience from all of those, I just don't have much ammo left. <laughs> That's the only problem. It eats this ammo. They cripple, I cripple them, they just sit there like ducks. <laughs> Super mutants are hilarious if you fully cripple them. No news about possible flame effects. Unfortunately, no. There is no news about it. And crippling super mutant hand caused him to detonate. The one with a mini nuke. Oh, there is a fire starter. Can you actually cripple it? It's already dead. He was touched by a legacy weapon. Oh, there is another one. Don't know if I crippled him, but I did hit him. Another fire starter. I don't think they can be crippled. Pretty sure they're immune. Am I tanky enough? Almost. I still get quite a solid damage. Like, they hit me quite hard. And I need a better pepper shaker. Like, this pepper shaker is... Like, reduce weight is nice. Damage while aiming is not what I'm looking for. Like, I want faster fire rate and less AP cost. Or anything, but especially I'm looking for faster fire rate, like vampire faster fire rate. That would be amazing for me. Boom. And why do I need faster fire rate to use a single bar? 
That that's the reason I need it. Let me toss a grenade on him. What? I have no grenade loaded? New grenades. Do I have grenadier? Yes. Eat it. Oops. That's not exactly what was planned. Yeah, this is why Legacies need to go. Legacy weapon. Unfortunately, on events, imagine there is some new player that joined the game, let's say, a month or two ago, and then he discovers that there are super OP players that can one-touch kill everything with any distance, and he cannot do anything. That's very, like, discouraging. Like, even stealth builds. Stealth builds are powerful, but can kill only one target at a time. Legacy is no such issue. Legacy player can kill all the targets in the same time, instantaneously. So that's the main difference. You see what's happening here? They die before I am even close. And I'm using Shaker for tagging, so... That's not like I need to touch them. Oh, chains. Chain stuff is happening. This server is struggling now. Whoa, another fire starter. Oh no, reload. He will be dead. Out of ammo. Back to axing action. Back to axing those overlords. At least I can kill fire starters real fast. I intentionally not picking up any loot yet. Because after I pick it up, I will not be able to move. So I will wait with that. Fire starter is down. Oh, why are you. Why are you hiding underground? Get out! <laughs> Super mutants hiding underground. Bum hat! Thanks a lot for two bucks and wave emoji. Thank you. I'm waving back. <laughs> waving back to you. Thank you for two bucks. We have one minute left, so Super Mutants will stop spawning now. Whatever is here, is here. Stop dying, Super Mutants. I need to touch you. I'm the melee build. That's the last spawn wave. That's the last spawn. <laughs> is everyone behind me? But there is another super fire starter there. Can I get there before he will be dead? Fire starter. Oh, there is a bunch of legendaries and fire starters. That's a free star, I think. They all dead. I'm quite certain they all dead. That's the end. A swap on sound back is still way fast. This back is not yet fixed. Okay, they all dead. Time for looting. The looting can begin. So we are starting from this side. Looting everything. 
including quite a lot of caps. I'm already over encumbered after one button press, but that's okay. We are moving this way and looting the bodies from time to time. Just keep moving and looting. Let's see how much loot we'll get. Oh, I leveled up again. Oh, more legendaries. Oh, Lauren in Wasteland. Thank you a lot for free bucks, Lauren. Appreciate that. And my hero fox emoji. Thank you, Lauren. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Almost done looting. Almost done looting. I think I done looting because the button is gray now. So it does look like I looted everything. That I was allowed to. Let me make sure. Run a little bit towards the middle. Is there anything I missed? No, I think I looted what was lootable for me. There are bodies, but I was too far to loot those, I bet. So I will now... I'm getting more and more meat. I need to get rid of some of that. I'm barely walking. Can I loot those? No, that they were too far. Let me go to this tent. Yes, that is Auto Axe build. Auto Axe build is super fun. I have it. That's bloody Auto Axe build. If you need all the details, it is on my channel. So I'm carrying... Yeah, almost 1000 pounds and that with perks reducing weight. So yeah, that is a lot of stuff. Look at, oh, uh, to get more loot from those weapons, I will temporarily equip scrapper as there is so much that I pick up. So scrapper would be a good idea. Look at that. That is all to be scrapped. Leather, steel, plastic, other stuff. Look how much is there. Super sledges. And that on top of all the legendaries that I pick up. And armor pieces for scrapping. Okay, I will show you now. How much I looted. Was it worth it? How much stuff do I have? Under my junk category now? Before I store it? Look at that, that's all the loot. 48 plastic, 35 cloves, some leather, rubber, 500 steel scrap, 100 wood. This is all from just those 10 minutes on this event. On top of level up, like insane amount of experience, I leveled up. I really need this buff from time to time, I keep forgetting to use it. No, they're not removing legendary mods on Grenade Launcher. Who said that? The only thing that they are removing is what you currently cannot get in the game. Like, if you cannot roll particular legendary on a weapon you want to roll as a legendary, they are removing it. That's what's happening. Okay, now to the train station. Oh, the arena uncensored. Thanks a lot for another two bucks and the we uh, the weapon. And the message from you is: legacy weapons should be allowed in private wards. Yeah, that would be a solution. But if they remove it like completely, it will not be possible. Still not reset. Not good. We sort out now my 8 category. I don't need this blood fly meat. I want my blood bags. I don't need bourbon. Don't need this Brahmin meat. I have enough. Cat meat. It's not very useful for me. Cave cricket meat. 
chicken thigh. Uh, squirrel bits, I don't need it. I need death glow eggs. I should actually check for more death glow eggs. Death glow meat is spoiling. I need to go look for death glow eggs at some point. Okay, I will sell it before it's spoiled. Oh, cups not reset either. What time I was playing yesterday? I was sure I was playing on the evening. Maybe it was night. I don't know. Nothing is reset yet. I don't know what time I was playing that nothing is reset yet. Look at my... Is it my weight without any weight reduction perks? Or what this is showing? 63,000? No, that's a little bit too much. I, I never can figure out what is this weight that those legendary exchange machines are showing. What is 63,000 of what? I don't think I could reduce weight of such a massive amount enough. Do you have any power armor pieces? Yeah. So let's try to put them on the frames. Let's grab those frames out again. Okay, what do we have? Let me try. There is a room for torso and left leg. Nope. Nope. Okay, that's not then. There is a room for right arm. So I can add that. Right leg? No, no room for... Unfortunately, I'm full on right legs. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, right leg. What is the lowest star right leg? That's all three star right legs. That's a two star right leg, and my right leg here is two star two. So, unfortunately, no, they need to wait until this stuff resets. Okay, I'm doing good. Like, I stayed. I can still use carry weight booster, so I'm good. Reset! Okay, I will probably check out later. It's not resetting. Okay, I was doing the daily. Which daily I was doing? Uh, Medical supplies from where? Braxons. Oh, Braxons. Braxons. I know where it is. By name. Yeah, I have multiple crafting guys on my channel. If you are looking into crafting something, meat buffs, herbivore buffs, experience buffs, how to optimize your farming route, everything is in there. Oh, and Testio Metal up at Radic? Okay, we'll just quickly grab that and going for Testio Metal. We are having luck with those random events. Okay, let's search this computer. And where is the container? Container is... Oh. What is... That's rude. Go away. And minigun. It's on the floor here. Oh, cups. We'll finish it in a moment. Let's go for test your metal first. Oh, it's inside the nuke zone. I just fast traveled there. I forgot if you nuke for air, test your metal is irradiated. No. Don't die. I will be overcumbered anyway, so I can use Hell Eater power armor. Nope. Nope. Enter it. No, I bug out. I will die here. Nope. No. That's game over for me on this event. It will take a time before this game will unbug itself now. I hate this bug. I can look around. I cannot move. cannot do anything. Until I will get teleported into my power armor eventually. If I don't die from rats in the meantime. Oh, I survived. 
Whew. Save me. <laughs> we survived. Okay, I need food buffs. Blood back steak. The brain, I think, is still running. Liver. Good soft shell. That's probably enough. The F2 F Wellington should be still running. Over a camber, that is fine. I'm here to heal those brotherhood guys. I'm here, I'm here as a healer. But occasionally I can toss a grenade and hopefully hit everything. Yeah, that's what we'll be doing. I just need regular right away. Radex diluted right away. That will do it. That's what I'm doing. I will be tossing those grenades on the middle and killing those guys when they need it. Brotherhood people in hazmat suits. Our brotherhood guys are in here. What's the highest DPS heavy gun? Like, assuming you can, you can VATS or not, like, if you can use canned coffee, that changes a lot, but, yeah, depend what, what your luck can be. Like, at this moment, my luck is 25, like, if I would get a heavy gun with less, like, crit charging faster, with high luck build, crit charging faster, I can do insane damage as heavy gunner in VATS with Kant Coffee. And now Kant Coffee is quite widely available, so that changes a lot. Oh, where is the Brotherhood Rifleman? There you are. I'm killing him. Explosions everywhere. This event is hilarious. This arena with all the grenades and stuff going on. My meat production is going strong. Oh, emote. Yeah! I'm prepping for the final round. Why did I just get 150? Are we done? Final round. One more right away, probably. If you don't use canned coffee, don't use vats. For bosses, it will be still heavy gunner with a flamer. Even though you cannot use any other barrel than standard, heavy gunner with a flamer will be the best for the bosses. They tag them all. But no, maybe let's toss one more for a good measure. What is going on? <laughs> toss grenade on the middle, it covers entire arena, so I'm good. Are we done? Not yet. Okay, one more grenade. That should do it. Are we done? Oh, not yet. One more nade. 
epic. Now we're done. What? Where? How did they die? What killed them? Was it paying attention? How is this bot still alive? They fine? Yeah, we won. Don't know what was going on at this final round, but we got it. Looting time. What? I, oh, okay, I mean power armor. That's why I'm so over encumbered. I need to make it out of the nuke zone. Okay, other way. I need to travel. I need to travel on foot. I'm severely over encumbered. To travel this way. This way. Luckily, I have head jetpack. I don't know how long those head jetpacks will be allowed, as Bethesda seems to be addressing more of this stuff lately, surprisingly, really, but that's okay. Yeah, this is total chaos and everyone loves it, that's true. <clears throat> yeah, let me use one canned coffee, I don't want to keep stopping and slowing down. Hello there, stacks. Almost out of the nuke zone. With canned coffee, I can walk over encumbered and I'm still regenerating AP. And now I can exit the power armor. Okay, still over encumbered though. Oh, my foot expired, so... Where is my... Where is my pepperoni roll? Drink one chair, pepperoni roll. Still slightly low, but I still have carry weight booster. Oh, that's the last one. Okay. Oh, my weapon is breaking. Okay, fix that. Everyone on train station. I'm joining you guys. I could use my survival tent, but that would not help me. I don't need to store stuff too much. I need to get my... Oh, finally! <clears throat> it finally reset. <laughs> finally. It reset. Let's scrap the one and two stars first. Eighty five left, so we can see what's heavy. When this integrator is heavy, so I have currently reduced melee weight perks, so shotguns. Oh, this shotgun is super heavy. Crowd control is reduced weight, so regular shotgun. And we have enough for one thing later. Perfect. Did caps reset too? Reset! Awesome. <laughs> we can we can sell remaining stuff then. Those carrots will spoil. Let's let's get rid of that. Meat will spoil. Galper inners. Crab meat I like. Uh, 
regular Marluk meat, I don't need, moldy food, more rat meat. Meat fruits? Possum, a possum meat is not needed. No, that's my pie. Pork and beans, potato crisps. I don't need all this purified water. Queen, rabbit, rad road. Mm, razor grain. Roasts, roast stuff is mine. Have plenty of salt. Don't need this sealed bean. Squirrel, I need squirrel. No, I don't need squirrel bits. No, I need... Wait. Yeah, those are squirrel bits are required. Yes, I need them. Oh, starlight berries will spoil soon. I don't know if I need them or not. I don't need so much stingwing meat. Oh, those are regular sugar bombs. Not irradiated. I don't need. Syrup, potato, moonshine, wine. Okay, that's sorted. Now, what's under eight categories? Tuck weight. Super stims, radaways. I don't need all those radaways. I will reduce the number. Radex diluted. Uh, regular stims. Diluted stims, I don't need. Radexes, I don't need. Blood pack. High radiation fluids. Mm -hmm. I don't need those grape mantats. Okay, that's good. Oh! One cup left. I wasn't even paying attention. I got it all. Got it all done. And my weight is greatly reduced. Which is great. Now I can use this scrap box as someone put it in here. Let me see what do we have to scrap. Those are Saltron heads. And put it all into the scrap box. Including Saltron heads. Down to under 400. Amazing. How are the weeklies? What? Oh, I, I need to go to White Spring to finish quests. Finish quests. That's why vertebral fuel is nothing. Yeah, Deathclaw Gauntlet was good in Fallout 76 as well early on. <laughs> it was severely nerfed, that's true. All unarmed builds have been severely nerfed. Yeah, give me the bonus. What bonus did I get? Steam pack boost, plus 25 steam pack effectiveness for doing this daily. This is a good boost. I like it. Yeah, the soup burned. How that happened, I don't know. Would you like some burnt water? Thank you. Now that's done. Complete an event. Still not done with it, but I, I still need to log in tomorrow. Get two more days. What is tomorrow? Sunday, Monday. Okay, I still can finish though. Sunday, Monday. Scoreboard. What are the rewards? Nuclear keycards. They really want me to drop more nukes, but this server is done. Large Voltex supply package. Lunch boxes for free. Legendary modules for me. And I need those carry weight boosters. Can I get gold bullion too? And sweet atoms. And next one will be more legendary modules. So I want that too. I like double score. So much stuff that you are getting for free. Close to full on this bullion again. 
and Minerva has nothing for me. Is there like a quick event? A real blast? That's not a quick event. Not necessarily slow either, but not a quick one. And that's the only one available. Okay, a real blast. The scoreboard and next month. You have approximately three to four weeks. We don't know exactly yet. Members, our view of the outside world has been once again Oh, I don't remember. What was the spikes to perk from Esma? I don't remember. I was checking them in the past, but I forgot what they are doing. The lures. Signal detected. Activate additional signal sources to initiate extermination protocols. You want to farm ant meat? Why do you need ant meat? Ants quite often are attacking this death claw, that's what I know. But there is more places with ants, I just cannot think about them now. But there is definitely more places with those ants. Fixing. Ugly more rat. Oh, He's shooting from over there. I'm running. Oh, someone else is running. Okay. There. Target locked so I can chase those remaining glowing miners. And those two guys are just drinking whiskey. And using some psychotats. So that that's why they are so crazy. Can I have all this loot? Whoa! I was hit by a rocket. Just looting here in peace and the rackets are dropping. Oh, how did you survive that? Done. There is one hostile. Oh, okay. There is none. That's probably was the one that I just killed. That is done, and swarm of suitors. That was fixed, so we can go there. It's no longer bugged, I think. Just need two. No, this event, one more event, and I will get my legendary modules. And I can check those ants for you real quick. Okay, I will just sit in here and check those ants for you. Let me see. <clears throat> uh. 
grad and a yeah, substation that I know of and oh it's one place I didn't know about okay we'll check it after this event two places two places where ants can spawn so it does look like ants can spawn at abandoned bunker and next to dam so we'll check if ants are actually there and then we figure out what kind of drink do you want to craft from those ants. Ah, it was too slow. Going on the island. But I got chicken. For my effort. Next wave of Marlux. Defeat the wave. Yeah, I don't... I don't have a weapon to compete here. Would need to be using my legacy. That's the... That's the way to compete here. That's the way. <laughs> I do have it. It will disappear with everyone else, so... I could, like, do that. Now it's too late. Everything is dead. So that's what everyone is doing on events. Let's take this and swing around. Let's see if there are ants. Oh, you're crafting rat ant lager. Oh yeah. But does rat ant lager stack with carry weight booster? I need to test it. I'm not sure if it's stuck. I'm not sure if you can have both. Uh, that's enter what? Ants. I don't see any ants. Supposedly they should spawn somewhere in here. Maybe this way? I don't know. I don't see any ants. Maybe on top there and not on the bottom. Maybe I am on the wrong side. Or map have it wrong? Maybe on top. Let me see on top. Oh, Jairas! Thanks a lot for five bucks! And Jairas is saying it makes rant at lager 50 carry weight for a short while. Yeah. Thank you a lot. Now we know. And uh, no, those are blood bugs here. They have been ticks that died. And there's some kind of a settler shooting from top. There's government aid drop. So I don't see ants. Maybe it's only a chance to get ants here and not guarantee. This is possible. Oops. That's dead turtle. Uh, why is subscriber only in chat? Because I was getting so many bots spamming the chat that I needed to change it. There was too many bots like spamming advertisements. It was crazy. I can change it back if YouTube already sorted this out, but I don't know. Since I changed it to sub only, it's nice, peaceful and everything under control. Yeah, I will check inside the bunker. Now inside the bunker we have uh, red roaches. Not ants. So I don't know. Should there be ants inside? I see only roaches. There's more roaches. There are definitely roaches. I don't see... No, there's no ants. Only roaches. So the other place that's supposed to have ants is this Kvesedam. Yeah, I know about power station, but I'm looking for different place with ants. And I think Enclave place, Enclave research station has one ant. But that's probably not enough, but there is one ant. We are looking for more ants. So we are here, so... 
should be somewhere in this direction. There are definitely super mutants on the inside, but we are looking if there are ants too. So ants, if anywhere, they would be on the bridge. Or around the bridge. Ants! I found it! There are ants! I mean one. There is ant. One ant. Maybe sometimes there is more. I don't know. I found one. So, yeah, if you are looking for ants, at least one, it's under the... Oh, no, that's a rat. At least one is on the dam. <laughs> I found one. So, there is ant. So, another one will be... Uh, any events going on? No events. Another one will be in one of my favorite place, Enclave Base. There should be one more ant in there. Oh, it does stack that ant lager with everything else. That's cool. Oh, inside for Defiance. Yeah, I forgot about that. Yeah. They sometimes spawn there instead of blood bugs. Yeah, there is a chance. You just don't know what will spawn, but yeah, there is a chance for ants. But here should be like a guarantee ant. Open the door. Always press the top button, not the bottom button. And we are running in. Looking for ants, not this Yagwai, but we'll, we'll loot this Yagwai too. There will be Mr. Muffman. What? Where are you, Mr. Muffman? There. Oh, who cares? We are not here for Muffman. We are here looking for ants. So ants, is it there or next one? We have blood bag, Wendigo, blood fly. Teak. So no ant. Oh wait, I hear magazine. Where is it? Here? <gasps> Bubble hat! Lock picking. Okay, that's not a useful one. There will be ant. That's a cricket. Have a cricket. Rad rat. Maybe there is no ant. Cricket. Rad rat. Where is... There is no ant. Mole miner. There is ant! I knew it! There is one ant. I got you. I got you covered. I found... I found for you... Three places with ants. One ant transmission station. One ant at Crevested Dam. And a bunch of ants attacking Deathclaw and Thunder Mountain substation. So we go there, but it's important to sprint straight in because this Deathclaw will kill those ants real quick. Yeah, tea time, campfire, taste, spawn ants, but... This event is not frequent, so that's a problem. Let's see. Sprint. The ants. Ants! I'm fast! Ants! Oh, Deathclaw is dead, actually, so that's how ants survive. See, there are ants. 
normally like to increase your chance if you want to get those ants i discovered how it works those ants i was like they spawn somewhere around those trees and uh, they spawn somewhere here and they march towards the death glow so if you want to get like a guarantee shot on those ants you spawn at drop side g3 and run towards the substation so you have higher chance to cut the ants off <laughs> that's that's a trick do you have any more events there's like no events at all so protest march death blossom okay there are some events powering up poseidon census violence okay some events are spawning but i don't want those I just need one, I think, so I can do it. Yeah, I will do it tomorrow. I think I'm good for today. I'm loaded. I did everything. I'm good for today. I'm quitting. That's enough. That's enough. I need a break. I was gaming yesterday. I was gaming today. Oh, I hope you had a little bit of fun, guys. Thank you a lot for all those likes. And thanks a lot for all the donations. And thanks to all the members. You are, guys, keeping this channel up and running no matter what. Legacy, no legacy, new content, no new content. Like, we survived like a year without any new content. Having a blast in the Fallout universe. Which is amazing. And now we are we are getting new content every three months. So that surprises even me sometimes. I was fully expecting, to be honest, I was fully expecting New Coward on Tour to be delayed until 2023. But so far it does look like it's coming on time at the end of this month. So that is something. So definitely improvement from Bethesda. They are doing way more than they used to this year. So someone asked me, was it good that they hired external studios for help? I would say yes. I can see improvement. So I would say definitely yes. And thank you for all the turtle emojis. <laughs> thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. You are amazing. The Fallout community is the best ever, and I will not change my opinion. Regardless how hard you will try to convince me that's the best community ever. Can you find someone who's toxic in Fallout 76 community? Yes. But point me to one community where it's not a single toxic person. This just doesn't exist. So it doesn't change anything. It's still the best community. With the highest number of amazing people of all communities. Thank you for joining the stream, everyone. And now I hope you will have a really good evening. You would have a blast if you will continue gaming. Or you will have a blast if you continue doing whatever else you want to do. I need to finish cooking my dinner. as That's what I was doing before the live stream and I didn't finish. I'm doing a bigos. That's a Polish dish. But I'm doing a vegan version. So I need to get back on it. So I'm behind. Obviously, you can notice that it's quite late for a dinner. So I'm going to fix that stuff. And that being said, thank you a lot for watching and see you in the next one, everyone. Turn to loud.